Hello everyone. I was out on the lot taking pictures of this unit. Um, this is in our pre-owned section um, and I just had to take a video of it because the floor plan is absolutely amazing. This is a 2017 Montana. I don't even know what model it is. I'll point that out once we get up there and there's not even a price for it yet just because this act this came in yesterday I believe but I just had to take a video of it. So let's go ahead and get started. You have your frameless windows across, which look really, really good. Two sets of awnings on this camper. Um, so you have complete shade if you need it. Outside speakers, you have your propane, um, one on this side and the other. And then you got your battery box and just a little bit of extra storage up front. You even have a humongous amount of pass-through storage, which is really, really nice. And you also have an outlet out here as well as inside your um, pass-through storage. So if you needed to plug something in, you can do that. You even have your um, vacuum system all the way in your pass-through storage. So you can hook up your nozzle and sweep out the inside of your pass-through storage. Maybe your car, you don't have to bring a broom with you or anything like that. Um, so it's really nice that, that is built in. You got your solid steps at your entrance as well as your helper handle. And then it's pretty close fit, but you have an outside TV. Again, with those frameless windows all the way across. And then the very back just looks cool. It has these like indents in it, which is part of the design. I don't know, I just think it's something different, adds a little bit of dimension. You also have a rear view camera and this rear ladder, so you do have um, a chance to get up on your roof and keep up with maintenance because of that. So let's go ahead and look at the inside. I'm so excited. And this is the 3921FB. Don't mind that sound. I believe it is the smoke detector. Um, so all of that should get fixed. So starting with our kitchen, you do have a coffee bar right next to your main entrance. Put your coffee maker here, your air fryer, any small appliance that you want. Storage below as well as above. And then you just have a lot of extra pantry space to the left of that. But lots of things in here. But it's also a spot, which I didn't even see this before, for your washer and dryer so it is prepped for a spot for that pretty cool and then kind of diagonal is your residential size stainless steel refrigerator so a lot of extra space and less trips to the grocery store to the left you have your three burner top and this is also stainless steel different design i think it looks really cool i like that this is separated from the oven it's just something different and then there's your oven extra storage down below and countertop space and i believe this is if i can figure out how to do it yep you just have a pull up outlet and usb port so you can again plug a small appliance in there if you need to residential size stainless steel microwave and you even have a wine rack up above with some cabinet space just across you have even more storage on your gorgeous island the, this cabinet or I guess drawer on the right is trash can storage and then you have your stainless steel 50 50 split sink if I can figure this out with my left hand there we go and then you have your spray nozzle for your faucet plus a really cool shaped accent light just above your island Right across is your freestanding dinette. Well, it is connected, but I still call it freestanding. Um, you can extend this out for extra tabletop space. There are two more sets of um, chairs that are stowed away. So you can have up, up to four people sitting here. And you have another one of those pop-up outlets. To the right, you got your theater reclining seats with four sets of cup holders. And these do have really cool accent lights. Um, and they do recline, so pretty awesome, pretty comfortable. Storage up above. And then you got your sleeper sofa. So this will sleep up to two people, guests, kids, family members, friends, they can come with you. Storage up above. And then of course you have your fireplace. 
Um, I believe this is electric, but I love the stonework around it. It just looks really cool, like an actual fireplace. And then you have your speaker system just up above. TV, even more storage. Let's see what's behind here. So this is where you can probably access your outside speakers um, and inside ones as well. And then last thing before heading upstairs, you have even more pantry space. So behind this door right next to your main entrance, it's one of those pivot style doors, is a half bath. So you do have a porcelain toilet right across from your entrance, extra storage space right across from your toilet. So you can put towels and washcloths there. And then of course your sink storage below it and above. So let's go ahead and close that extra space um, before you head up into the bedroom so you do have a coat rack or maybe put your keys or dog leash there and then you have your control panel right here so this does have the in command system so what's really cool about this is you download an app on your phone it is free and you are able to access all of your slide outs and turn your interior lights on all of that fun stuff from the app once your camper is plugged in or you can just come in and simply do it through this touch screen. So it's a really cool feature that they added, or I guess had. Coming up into our master bed, king size bed with storage underneath. You do have end tables on both sides with a couple um, small cubbies and then extra wardrobe space. Fit lots of things in there. Built in clothes rack as well. Right across is a humongous dresser, two sets of huge drawers, outlet if you need it, and then you have your um, TV, extra storage space, and then this is amazing. The best part of this camper is this humongous front bath, gorgeous. I've never seen a camper with a full-size tub before, so this is absolutely amazing. You have the matching countertop that is from that half bath and the kitchen. So it's just all cohesive. You even have this extra step up there to help you get up. But look at this view. Of course, this is tinted. It's not completely blacked out. Um, you do have this blackout curtain. So if you are using the bath, you can kind of have that privacy. But there is a lot of natural light coming in. And just the fact that there is a full size tub in here is just amazing. Um, and then, of course, you have extra storage to the left of that. You can hang up your towels, robes, things like that. Plus, if you're not a bathtub person, there's also a sit-down shower. And this even has a lot of room to turn around in, stand in, with that natural skylight coming in. Porcelain foot flush toilet. And then right across, you even have a double vanity so storage all down below two sinks people can get ready at the same time you don't have to cram all in one bathroom and then two medicine cabinets plus even more storage right next to your toilet so that is it for this montana guys again i don't even know what the price is yet because it just came in yesterday i believe so i can get that for you guys but just wanted to go ahead and show you because I thought it was a pretty cool looking floor plan. So if you have questions or concerns, please let us know.